everybody at the Woodlands Children's Museum. My name is Sarah Mitchell and I was so excited to do a story time with you at the Children's Museum this spring, but unfortunately, like everything in life right now, it was canceled. So I am super, super excited to be a part of this virtual book week. So thank you for having me. Um, I am a mom and a writer and I live here in the Woodlands. I'm the author of two children's books, um, Love Love Bakery, which is based on a local bakery. And what I'm gonna be reading to you today, every day is making day. And I'm also the author of a tiny book of poetry that I actually sewed together since we've been staying at home. That was a really fun project. So FYI, you can sew your own books. You should try it, it was really fun. Okay, so the book I'm reading today is called Every Day is Making Day. It's brand new, it just came out um, on New Year's Eve 2019. So it's just a few months old. It is all about creating in many, many, many different ways. Since you've been home, I'm sure you have made lots of things. Things that maybe your parents or grandparents or caregivers um, told you to make and probably lots of things that you came up with on your own. And I say, go you. You have incredible ideas and I think you should trust those ideas and do them today. Okay, let's get started. Every day is making day. This book is illustrated by Priscilla Ornelas, an artist living in New Mexico. Rip, snip, scribble, doodle, dabble, brew, calling all makers, inventors, and creators. This invitation is just for you. Do you want to make something, create, dream up, invent, and shape something? Make what you can make. Make it today. Today is making day. Ready to build? Build a tree house for your dream house. Build a robot to pour your orange juice. Build what only you can build. Today is building day. Want to quilt a quilt of quilts to stretch from sea to shining sea? Or tailor a grand new flag to wave in parades? How positively brilliant and brave. You so should sew something. Today is a good day for stitching things together. I like to call this the making day parade. Wouldn't you love to bake something, whisk and twirl and shake something? Whip up a colossus of cookies, a pile of pies, make a raspberry lemon cake 31 layers high, filling the house, the neighborhood, the world with that lemony, buttery, yummy, yum smelling smell. We are hungry. Please bake it today. Today is baking day. Yum. That's my favorite kind of cake. Are you a music maker, a maraca shaker? Can you keep the beat strum in the street? Ready to sing, to scream, pound the drum and bang the keys. Round up your friends and let it ring. The stars at night are big and bright. Bitty bitty bom bom, ring a ding ding. Today is music making day. have a story to tell, a real lion of a story, 
ready to leap, ready to roar, or a spooky story to tell in a spooky voice. Do you want to shimmy around in verbs like prowling, howling, growling? Tell your story! Or write a play and say, this is the thing I came here to say. You can pop your ideas into a poem. It can rhyme or not. It can groove and flow in caps, or perhaps it can just stop and wait. You pen all the poems. We'll snap all the snaps. Today is writing day. Where will you begin? Today is the day to make the thing. Pluck out your feelings, your stories, swirling. Slap them between a once upon a time and a the end. Or blast them into blueprints. Do you know what blueprints are? Blueprints are plans for what you want to build. So take those things inside you and make a plan for what you want to build with them. Craft them into cake, stomp, spin, shake them out into a new dance, a new game. Make a video, pick up the pen or the drumsticks, the knitting needles or the camera. Wind them up and ride the wave over the wide open page. What are you waiting for? Today is a great day to dream something up. Or maybe you prefer questing through the quiet in your cozy cove. Sometimes it's nice to forget everything around you as you tinker, 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 putter and butts and monkey around, just you and the thrill of creation. Out of nothing, something. Today is creating day. No one, not Thad, not your dad, no one ever asks, Hey, yeah, can you build me a robot or arm that pours orange juice into a glass? Give it some glitter. Give it some sass. They can't. They won't. So don't wait for someone to ask you to make the thing that you were born to make. Just make it. Make it today. And one day, People will line up to ooh and ah at your glittery, sassy, eight-armed robotopus pouring orange juice and dancing the cha-cha. Today is inventing day. I just love that glittery bow on the robotopus's head. Didn't the illustrator Priscilla do such a great job. I just love it. What if someone else has the same idea as you? Should you stop? No! Make your idea anyway. We don't all have to say something new. Make what is good. Say what is true. Your thing is fresh when it's done fresh by you. Today is idea day. See, they're having the same idea. Now, repeat after me. Wow, what an artist I am. Incredible, unbelievable. The things I'm making will change the world. The things I'm making are important. Imagine what this brain, these hands, this 
voice can create. I should absolutely make more things every day. Wowie zowie, I'm burning up the sky. I'm golden. Today is Artist Day. Fear not and forward ho. So much code to write and chords to play and flowers to grow and words to rhyme before bedtime. It's time to invent, time to create. Just make the thing, make it today. Every day is making day. Now, are you inspired? Are you ready to make something? I hope you're ready to make something every day. And listen, you have incredible ideas and your ideas can change the world. So just listen to that voice inside you. Listen to your idea, perhaps get some grown up permission and then make the thing that you were born to make. I am so glad that you took the time to read this book with me today. If you don't have a copy, please get a copy. When you buy a book, that helps me to make more books. And I would love to write more books for you. You can find my books, Love Love Bakery and Every Day is Making Day, on my website. It's just my name, sarahtrianamitchell.com. I hope I see you in person when this whole thing is over. Maybe I'll see you at the Children's Museum or at the Grogan's Mill Farmer's Market where I like to go and meet neighbors. Um, and I have a little art activity uh, to show you something you can do with things that are just around your house. Uh, I'll describe it to you now and then I will show you what I mean. So, <clears throat> One thing that I did today with my daughters that you could easily do without buying any more supplies, probably, I hope, is we made a house, a dream house, just like it says in my book, out of a cardboard box, paper, glue, and washi tape. You don't have to have washi tape. You could use markers or crayons or you could just um, cut shapes out of other paper. But all we did is we took our box and we put the bottom up and then we covered the entire box with paper. And then we just started adding doors and windows um, out of tape or you could use markers or crayons or paper um, to the front and in the back we designed a garden. And I will show you what I mean and then 